Can you block add on the Roku? The answer is yes, you can. And I'm gonna show you not one, but two, often three ways to quickly deal with ads on the Roku TVs or streaming device. The more the merrier, right? Oh, by the way, I'm currently displaying Roku Player on this laptop. If you want to do the same thing with any other streaming device, we have got a video on that, so come and check it out. All right, let's get into the video. Let's talk a bit about how does Roku display ads when connected to Wi-Fi. After some hands-on testing with my router, I've cracked the code to block ads on Roku. The circuit lies in filtering out the URL associated with Roku ad. Simply put, Roku delivers ads through the certain URLs. Let's call them the channels. When the Roku connected to the internet via a Wi-Fi router, it automatically gains access to the channel and then to the ads. Those channels are exactly the ones I showed on the screen right now, and I'm gonna walk you through the process. Okay, look, this guy will be kind of technical from now, so stay tight with the timeline below. First up, log into your router admin interface. Then find the firewall and URL filter. Here, make sure the feature is set to enable and the filter table should be set to deny list. Now, enter these three URLs into this router filter. You can just copy and paste from the description down below. After adding all URLs, click Apply to finish the process. Alright, let's have a look through the home screen menu on this Roku TV. You see that there's a blank right here, and so does this blank. Even when Roku gets access to the internet, of course, on our router's Wi-Fi, point to clicker there. Now, let's try to connect to the other router. Then back to the main menu. Well, it seems like the home screen spoke itself. Now, another way to disable Roku ads content that perhaps lots of people already shared is start from the secret menu. So, save this code. Home button 5 times. Up, right, down, left, up. Since there were a lot of videos that have brought this tutorial out of secrecy, but still, not many guys noted that this menu gives us access to the ads appearance. In there, Psycho Storable Ads change the status to always disable by pressing the OK button. Then, head to Psycho Home Screen Ad Banner Server. Click on it to change the status. This time, the option should be Demo 1 to 3. This action prompts for reducing the presence of both scrollable and menu banner ads. Now, it's playing down there, clean and neat. But for my case, blocking ads from this screen doesn't always work. So, if you haven't succeeded yet, let's try until you see the ads was out. But if you're like me, it's not the ad themselves that bother you, but the content is. Or perhaps, if you have kids at home, you might be concerned if they can see the inappropriate ads that could appear on the Roku. So come here, let me tell you. You can entirely control the ad contents on Roku. Head to Settings, Privacy, Advertising, check for personal ads. This preset will basically help you filter out ad content, tailoring it to align with your streaming history. Besides, certain Roku versions also enable you to control sensitive ad content within this preset. This preset will limit your exposure to certain types of ads like sexual, horror, content, etc. which you might find disturbing. To do so, simply mark on the category you want to avoid. Alright everyone, that's it for today's video. But keep this in mind, Roku always update, so this method might not work for everyone. If the tips work or do not work for you, please drop a comment down below to let everyone know. Once again, if you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to support our team. Thanks for tuning in. Catch you in the next video. Peace out.